Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Gemini, June 27, 2023. Murky vibes will be lingering ahead for you. Unfortunately, Mercury, our cosmic messenger planet of the mind and communication spinning in your solar of secrets, will clash with mysterious Neptune. This ensures that deception, drama, and scandals could be lying behind every corner. Don't share your ideas with others today. If you are feeling anxious or receiving a nagging feeling that something is off in your personal or romantic life, table it until you can think more clearly in the coming days. You'll be glad that you didn't overreact. Having a clear mind is key to moving forward. The fear of the future can be intimidating to handle, so it might be time to work on your coping mechanisms when Mercury in Gemini squares Neptune in Pisces. Although the next stage of your professional journey might be unclear, this does not have to be scary. You may need to work through your anxiety about your professional journey to feel more at peace with the progression of your career path and what that may mean for your next adventure. As Mars moves into his final two weeks in your income sector, thanks to both the Moon's recent visit and a friendly aspect to planets on the career front over the last few days, there is a new sense of confidence awareness and resolve. This is giving you the confidence to fight for what you deserve, drawing on what has already been invested professionally while knowing that with Venus, the planet of money staying on in your income sector until October, time is your friend. Keeping things in balance is never a done deal, there is always another day with things that need tweaking, issues that need ironing out. Give yourself the benefit of regularly balancing what you eat, in order to satisfy that desire for equilibrium. Eating fresh, organic produce is one of the best things you can do for your health. But you don't always have to be the one who cooks. Treating yourself to takeout once in a while can have a relaxing effect. Your hardworking nature may prevail today. Yet, on a day like this, you may want to take some time to reevaluate your goals and the direction that you have taken in order to pursue them to their fullest. Give some serious thought to the next steps that you may want to take. The route to success is a well-thought-out battle plan with strategic organizing. Yet, with you at the helm of it all, you need to be sure that you give yourself the nurturing and reflective time you need, too. For days into your birthday month and new solar there is likely to be a sense that you are still waiting for something. That something is Mercury, who until joining the Sun and the asteroid Juno, the queen of commitment in Cancer tomorrow is using his last full day in a nostalgic and reflective part of your chart to wrap up this old solar. There has been planetary activity here since Mars returned last August to spend seven months winding down your old Mars cycle, bringing you to a point where you are ready to move on. It is just before the moon leaves your communication sector and wraps up both its first visit since the Dwarf Planet series left and the last before Mars returns in 14 days that it forms a friendly aspect to Pluto, for the first time since his return to your communication sector. While this had been a monthly event until Pluto left in March and will continue to be until leaving again in January, this is a chance to ensure the communication lines are open in the early days of your birthday month and new solar. Our Eyes in the Sky Today, the celestial dance of Pluto retrograde creates challenging squares with the nodes of destiny, indicating that significant shifts and unexpected events may unfold. Brace yourself, for these situations could unravel in a dramatic and unforeseen manner. Be attentive to the stories circulating at your workplace, particularly those involving your boss or other figures of authority. The information that comes to light could be truly shocking, potentially altering your perspective on the situation for an extended period. Fortunately, your radiant and exuberant outlook is adored by those around you. People are drawn to your cheerful demeanor, making you feel at ease in their presence, as if you were old friends. Your genuine interest in others' lives brings you immense satisfaction, especially when you see the joy on their faces. It is advisable to nurture your connections and maintain as many contacts as possible. You never know what remarkable outcomes may emerge from these relationships. 
It is important to acknowledge that you may not always feel entirely positive about yourself, and that's okay. Accepting this responsibility allows you to navigate your emotions with grace. Do not fret if you find it challenging to keep up with others or notice a slight decrease in your stamina. Instead of pushing yourself excessively and risking fatigue, pay attention to the signals your body sends you. Take short rests when needed, as it is more beneficial in the long run. Now is an opportune time to indulge in some well-deserved retail therapy. Treat yourself to something nice, but rather than splurging on a single item, consider investing your money wisely. Take advantage of the advice and honesty offered by the people around you. Whether you plan to make a small purchase or embark on a significant financial endeavor, rest assured that you cannot lose, even if you end up spending more than your usual budget. As the friendly alignment between the asteroid Juno and the south node in your financial sector reaches its peak, the moon concludes its visit to your work sector, where it has formed a harmonious connection with the North Node and the planets residing in your income sector. This synchronous interplay of cosmic energies has facilitated a boost in confidence and heightened awareness on both sides of the financial spectrum, without triggering any conflicts or rivalries. As you enter the final three weeks of the Lunar Node's presence in your two money houses, a newfound sense of assurance and enlightenment is likely to emerge. The moon's affable interaction with the north node in your income sector during its journey through your work sector in recent days, combined with the sun's friendly alignment with the south node in your financial sector, fosters a greater ability to comprehend and appreciate both aspects of your financial situation. These celestial influences pave the way for a balanced approach as you near the end of an 18-month mission to harmonize the inflow and outflow of money. In the current phase, you may find a lack of motivation and initiative, resulting in minimal productivity. Instead of becoming overly frustrated, it would be wise to wait until you regain your customary drive and capability to take action. If feasible, allocate some time for yourself and wholeheartedly devote it to your personal needs. Embrace the value of engaging in activities that involve doing nothing, allowing yourself complete freedom and liberation.